My name is Jim Estes, and today I'm going to talk about a drill that I think is extremely important for the swing plane. So what I want you to do is, and this, by the way, is going to give you an instant understanding of exactly the feeling you want to have in the golf swing. Take a club. You can put a rod, alignment rod, in the grip, or I'm sorry, in the butt end of the golf club. Take the golf club, turn it like you're going to hold it, and then what I want you to do is take that club, put it right against your left hip, so you're holding both clubs here. Now you've got an alignment rod on the ground and a golf ball. And what I want you to do, getting into your good posture position, your weight over the arches, getting feel balanced. The insides of the heels are going to be about the width of your hips. Take a swing back, slow motion, and trace with that alignment rod the target line all the way up. The shaft should be parallel to your target line at the top. And then slowly coming down, trace the line. And do this in slow motion. Right into the impact position. So this is a great feedback tool, visual feedback tool, for learning the proper swing plane. Go right to your impact position. I encourage you to do this drill in slow motion. And if you have five minutes a day, if you do this drill every day, I guarantee you're going to improve your golf swing. So again, I think you'll find this to be extremely helpful. JimEstisGolf.com if you have any questions. Remember, you want to slide your hands down your thighs, pushing your hips back until you, you touch the top of your knees. But your hands need to be a little more underneath your shoulders. But this was a good swing. Club's going inside, John. That's too fast. Inside, and then the club came down underneath. But the takeaway, where should the takeaway be? The handle of the club. Your hands shouldn't move. The angle of this wrist shouldn't move. The club head should stay to the outside of your hands, like this. See that takeaway? So you want to keep your hands void of any hand action. Wherever the butt end of the club points, when you take it away, the wrists don't move. So you're getting a little bit underneath, a little bit inside on the takeaway. But that that's a pretty good downswing, I'll tell you that. That's right on line. So, you have to feel like you're set up a little shut with your shoulders. You feel like you're swinging out, right? That's the feeling you want to have. You getting all this? You look like you're dazed. Dazed and confused. I like how you rocked your weight back to your heels there. Hips went forward a little bit. Notice this move right here. See how the pelvis moves in a little bit there? Hello? Hello? Yeah, I got it. The pelvis was in there towards the impact. Yeah. But that's a better backswing, except it's too much to the inside. Downswing was really good.